In this video, I'll be showing you how to update your AMD chipset in Windows. So it's important to ensure that you do have the latest driver installed for your AMD chipset, as this will ensure that Windows is running at its best. And it will also help rule out any system crashes and other bugs or problems that you might encounter on your computer. As Windows will only find the best suitable driver it can detect for your chipset. And this driver could be very old. So the first thing that you need to do is click on the link that's in the description below. You will then end up on a page that looks like this. You now need to select chipsets. So the next thing that you need to do is find out what chipset you need to download. So as you can see, there are a few different options here. So I know that I need to select AMD socket AM4. However, you might not know this. And to find out what you need to select, you can find this out by simply opening up the start menu and then typing in system and then information. Now select system information. This will bring up a massive load of information about your computer. So over on the right hand side, I can see that my baseball product is a B450 Tomahawk Max. If you can't see your baseball product, then you can always find it out by either going into the BIOS or you can find the original packaging for your motherboard or find a receipt or something like that. So once you have found out what motherboard you have, you can then go onto Google and then search your motherboard. So I'm on the AMD website. And if I now scroll down, I can see the B450. And it says there that is an AM4 socket. So if I now go back to the AMD website, I now know that I needed to select AMD socket AM4, and then I can see my motherboard here, the B450. So once you've found out all that information, go ahead and press submit. The next thing that you need to do is select your operating system. So I've got Windows 10 64 bit. You will then see the AMD chipset drivers. So you now need to go ahead and press download. Once the file has finished downloading, go ahead and run the setup file. It's now ensuring that I have downloaded the right driver for my chipset. And as you can see, I've got all ticks, which means that's good. I can then go ahead and press install. But before you go ahead and install this, just make sure you have backed up any important files and data on your computer just in case anything was to go wrong. So once you're happy, you can now go ahead and press install. You can always choose what you would like to install as well, but I'm happy I want to just install everything. Once the install has finished, you can now go ahead and press restart. And there you go. That's how you update or install the latest driver for your AMD chipset. I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, click the like button below. And if you'd like to see more computer sluggish videos, then click on that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.